flojito. That's a bad ankle dislocation that was just popped back in. If you've never seen one before, it's a real emergency that needs quick action. Let me explain with x-rays. Ankle dislocations happen from strong forces like during a bad fall, sports injuries with awful landing. The ankle gets pushed beyond its limits and the bones shift completely out of place. The ligaments get torn or severely stretched. Now, look at this x-ray and see how the bones are not lined up at all. That's the problem. Here's why it's urgent. Blood vessels and nerves that run through the ankle gets compressed or kinked after a dislocation. If you leave them there for too long, you run the risk of permanent damage to that foot. Now, see how this foot with a dislocated ankle looks very pale? It's likely from compressed arteries and decreased blood flow to that foot. This is why a reduction or a popping it back in place needs to happen fast and only by trained medical professionals. This is not a YouTube DIY situation. Once it's reduced, we splint it to hold everything in place, but the work is not over yet. The injury almost always means major ligament damage. So without proper treatment, you may have long-term ankle instability, stiffness, or early arthritis. The recovery is not quick. It will likely take months, immobilization first, sometimes surgery, then physical therapy to rebuild strength, balance, and trust in that ankle again. Some people recover fully. Others deal with chronic pain, swelling, reduced range of motion, or higher risk of re-injury. The bottom line is that this is a serious injury that needs urgent care, proper alignment, and a long-term recovery plan. You ever had an ankle sprain or a dislocation? Let me know in the comment section and follow for more.